Good morning, folks. I'm going to fix my hat here. Hey, folks. So today is uh, day three of the uh, Devil's Path hike. It's, it's Thursday, I think. And um, we are getting ready to do either 6.6 or 9 miles today, depending upon where we want to stop. Cause if the weather holds true as it did in the beginning of the week, it's supposed to rain tomorrow. So if we stopped at our first uh, shelter that I planned on, we'd hike nine miles out, and I don't really want to do that in the rain. So we will, uh, <clears throat> Sergeant and I will either uh, stay where we're supposed to stay tonight or go an extra two miles to another shelter that's half a mile up the trail. So we'll see. It's a beautiful day today again. Temperature's about 60 it was pretty warm last night in the hollow. Um, that's we'll, we're, we're going up right away today. So stay tuned. Devil's Tombstone Campground is four miles. And then uh, Plateau Mountain Ascent, 1240. So 1,240 12, feet, 1,240 feet, straight up and a mile. That's pretty vertical. That's pretty vertical. A lot of water on this trail so far. We got water a little bit back. Now we're climbing up this mountain. Sorry, folks. <laughs> a little balancing act there. <sighs> Love hearing that when you're hiking. The sound of water close to the trail, except when it's on the trail in a rainstorm. That's not nice. Vertical climb, getting very, very steep. I can't see, but take my word for it, it's steep. Another 3,500 foot elevation sign. Still going up, I think we have to do, go up 37, almost 3,800. Well, I think we've made it to the top of Plateau Mountain. But, you know, I'm waiting for the next big up that I can't see that, that ends. But I don't know. I think we made it. The only way to get this done is one step in front of the other. As hard as it may be, that's the only way to do it. One step in front of the other. So we passed some day hikers. I asked about the weather for tomorrow on Friday. It's going to rain starting in the afternoon. So I think we're going to go the extra two miles to Diamond Notch Shelter. That happens to be, unfortunately, half a mile off trail. But at least that'll, uh, that'll save us two miles for tomorrow instead of nine and a quarter. We only have seven around there. So we'll put in the extra effort today and leave early in the morning. You know, hopefully get on trail by seven. Because we got one peak, West Kill, tomorrow. West Kill Mountain that we need to do. Yeah, we're up high. Alpine scrub. Definitely at the top. Get this long ridge 
well, I don't know how long it is. We're on top of the ridge. On top of the plateau. It's Plateau Mountain. Hopefully it's a long plateau. Well, not that long. We gotta get down off this mountain. This is the biggest climb of the day. Oh man, yep. But all good things must come to an end soon. When we get down off this thing. Devil's Acre 4.4, that's where we're gonna stay tonight. But we're gonna do an extra two miles. Devil's Path, watch. So, me and Kyle Lane too, we've already gone 2.4 miles. Plateau Summit, half a mile behind us. No, it's, it's fairly warm last night. So we're uh, hiking this nice bridge here. Uh, only about <clears throat> two miles to uh, Devil's Tombstone Campground, which where we may have lunch. But this is a pretty nice, pretty nice hike. Finally, we got a nice ridge walk after yesterday's hard hiking. And taking full strides, finally. This is our first nice view of the morning. A little overground. See a village down there. Sorry, it just looks like the Appalachians. You just did it. Dude, 2021. 20, 20, That's amazing. That comes from my, goes through my town. Oh, really? Oh, no way. Yeah, so when I got to... Uh, so now we're starting a 1,250-foot descent off that plateau mountain. Sarge is behind me. He takes his time going down. I don't blame him. Very sketchy, some of this stuff. So we go down to 2,000 feet where we're going to go to Devil's Tombstone Campsite, uh, campground. We'll have lunch there and then push on another four miles to Diamond Notch uh, Shelter. Oh, we made it down that long descent off of uh, Plateau Mountain. Now we're at, uh, we're at uh, Devil's Tombstone Public Campground. I think we're going to have lunch here. Some picnic tables over there. I think that's what we just came down from. We descended 1,250 feet into this uh, parking lot here. Some kind of campground. I don't know how it's a campground, but and it says no camping. So go figure. It's a picnic area. A picnic area. So Sergeant and I are going to picnic. Up, up, up after lunch. Came down from the gap 2,000 feet. And now we're, <clears throat> we have to climb initially 750 feet. And 
and it's about four miles to our shelter. Oh, I think I said that. <clears throat> Well, we've gotten to the top of this mountain, whatever it is. Now it's kind of leveled off to a nice woods uh, trail. Nice level trail. It took us an hour to get to the top. And I can only imagine we're only two miles from, uh, no, one mile from uh, Devil's Acre um, campsite, which is where we're going to first camp at. This is nice. I have to climb it for an hour. Go found the red blaze. That was like a lean to 0.1. Diamond notch lean to 2.6. We got the Devil's Acre lean to, and that was not a good spot to camp. The only place was the shelter. So we're going another 2.6. It's quarter to four. We're left there. 2.6 to Diamond Notch Shelter. I think I might have stayed there before with the AMC folks. But anyway, so we only have seven miles to go out tomorrow. About that. About seven. It'll be about eight and a half when we're all said and done, I think. So here we go. On to Diamond Knot Shelter. That looks nice. Tasty, tasty, tasty. We're getting close. We're a half mile, man. We, we hauled ass. It's only, we did uh, two, two miles in like an hour and 15 minutes. Wow, that's really nice. You know, we, need, we should go back to where that uh, last water hole was and get water. It's kind of sketchy getting water here. So we got water. Here's a view from the bridge. And we got the falls there before. So now we got 0.5 to our shelter for the night, and it's only 5:10. So we really moved. Very nice. So you see, Spruceton Road, where our car is, is only 7.2 from here for tomorrow. Another good decision. To come out this way. Now we're going to follow the blue trail to the shelter. Of course, they didn't mention that it's a half mile up <laughs> to the trail, uh, to the shelter. It's a mean trick when you've already done nine miles, nine hard miles. One foot in front of the other, that's how I'll get it done. Okay, folks, we're at the campsite. It's, uh, what time is it? 6.20. So we, uh, we made good time after <clears throat> that uh, Devil's Acre shelter, which was a crappy shelter to camp in. No campsites had to be in shelter. 
Water was great on the way down, as you saw. So we're set up. So we did about nine miles today, I think. Although my GP, my uh, Garmin says 8.1, which I doubt. So we're going to go with the nine. It sounds better. And we have a uh, half a mile back down to the trail, then uh, 7.2 to Spruceton. So we're going to get an early start before the rain comes in. Because we want to get over, I want to get over West Kill Mountain. Don't want to do that in the rain. So that's it, folks. Nine miles. And it's end of day three. So uh, see you tomorrow. See you on the trail. Thanks for watching. God bless.